Nice! This is just a general purpose merchant. Great. So he'll just buy pretty much anything we've got. sell my blunt sword. I like my blunt sword. My blunt sword and I have been through so much together. Alright, I can sell 22 of these. Six of these. Two of these. I'm gonna get his money. All right, y'all just wait, okay? I need these monies. Money, money, blah 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 blah. Oh, merchant baby. So. Sorry, I was listening to their, uh, them regale each other with tales of their alcoholic friend. Wait, did he just say... Oh, no, he said guards. Never mind. For a second, I thought maybe he said CODS! Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Wait a minute. Quest! Oh, wait, is that down there? That is down there. Yerp. Oh yeah, I should read the maps. Thank you. <laughs> Look at all that loot on that boat. What a waste of 
good loot. I mean, losing the, the pretty redhead is bad, too, but... Oh, good lord, I like her alternate outfit better. You look beautiful. Thank you. Nice to see you again. The eulogy. King Bran of Clan Twirsek has embarked on his final voyage. At its end, our glorious ancestors await him. Together, they will hunt and raid. They will sit round the fire and praise the deeds of ages past. For now, he lives in our hearts. One day, we too shall stand at his side and face the sea together. That will be a good day. Yes, he was well respected, unlike his wife. Skellige is his clan. In times of war, tradition holds the clans unite under the leadership of their king. We bid Bran farewell. Time to pick his successor who will lead us against the Black One. I nominate Geralt of Clan Rivia. stand open to all who held Bran of Clan Twilstach dear. Mead and meat will be plentiful. During the wake, those who believe themselves worthy of the crown will step forth. Come to the wake with me. Gladly. Feasts and scandal. So predictable. Slobbering drunks, brazen boasting, and the inevitable rows that result. Yeah. Nothing like the banquets majors attend. Remember the one on Thanet? You were there. How could I forget? I also remember excruciatingly well what happened after the banquet. What's more, I like what I see. I don't think he fears responsibility, Slim, but he wouldn't want to be tied down in one spot like that. So no, he wouldn't make a good king. Did you learn anything in Venom? Somehow Ciri wound up at the castle of the local ruler, a baron, self-proclaimed. This was after she was injured. Injured? Was it serious? Don't think so. Must have recovered because this baron sent her on to Novigrad. Think she was looking for you at the time. These witches Ciri came across, she was lucky to escape them. Witches? Creatures more like. Can't say exactly what they are, but they're dangerous. Very. Also ran into an old friend of ours in Velen. Kira. What on earth is Kira Metz doing in that way? Uh, Hiding from witch hunters. Uh, the There's flaming boat's coming back, guys. Mage had been there looking for Siri. Good. You'll need to tell me more when we have some time. Been to Novigrad. Siri was there, looking for a way to lift some curse. She's not there anymore. You're certain? Heard it from Dandelion, with no embellishments. Do you know any more about this curse? Not much. Siri ran into some trouble, never finished what she went there to do. I recovered a phylactery. She was looking for a way to enchant it. I'll look at it later. How about you? What have you learned? Something strange happened on Ard Skellig a time ago. A disaster brought about by a burst of magic. Extraordinary, really. Natural anomaly. Never seen anything like it. My intuition tells me Syria is its cause. As much as I respect your intuition, Yen, we need something specific. Evidence. I'd know for certain if I was able to inspect the disaster zone. Unfortunately, Ermion and his druids aren't letting anyone near. Ermion's head of the Skellige Circle? Haven't seen him since... Uh... Since Syria was a little girl. I doubt he'll do you any favors. 
not even for old time's sake. So why won't Hermion let you inspect the area of the anomaly? Call it a difference of opinion. A large, loud difference. Look, it's Krach. Wait, Wolf! Greetings, Krach. I shall see you at the wake. And I'll not accept any excuses. I have an important matter to discuss with you. I shall wear black and white for the beast. I count on you to don something complimentary. Something that doesn't reek of a thousand hearts. Yen, you know I can't stand new doublets. Just too tight till you break them in. And just like Clark, I will not accept any excuses. We're not here to enjoy ourselves. We've matters to resolve and should dress appropriately. Ah! I've rented a room at the inn. Took the liberty of laying out some clothes for you there. You ought to go. Choose them. Ah! In the meantime, I have something to attend to. We'll meet at the end. Everyone here is a ghost! Y'all, we're trying to have a conversation. Stop walking through us. Jesus. Uh, hey, look, a merchant. Hey there. Come take a dollar. I'm trying to. Looking to buy? Are you kidding me? Why the hell don't you people play Gwent? Oh, I gotta read the maps. Her. Wait, is this the so same guy? All right, I got to use the restroom, everyone. I will be right back. Take it down there. 